The Guinea Grill is the oldest steakhouse in London. Um, it's been a steakhouse since uh, rationing ended in 1952. And it's very well regarded and very well known. It has fantastic history and heritage. And uh, looking after that is key to my job and the job of the 30 odd people that we employ in the business to make sure that our customers have a consistent, brilliant quality experience and product every time they come in. We're a founder member of the Scotch Beef Club. We sell beef that is very, very hard to come by. And most of our beef is hung for between 30 and 40 days. We buy young steers from um, farms that we um, have great um, trust in. They're all grass fed. Um, it's cut specifically for the guinea. The cuts that we sell are French trimmed and uh, beautifully presented. Um, our customers have a high expectation and it's an expensive restaurant so we really try to get the very best quality beef that we can. Firstly, the Guinea is very well known for having all its meat on display when, when the customer arrives. So we pick the very finest cuts every morning and we put them on display. So as soon as the customer uh, steps into the restaurant, that display is there for them to see. They're, they're talked through the cuts and the animals and uh, the aging and the different um, choices they would have. Um, today we've chosen a beautiful rib of Aberdeen uh, Angus beef, uh, which has been 40 day aged, uh, cut specifically for us this morning by our butcher. Um, we're, going to cut that, we're going to cook that one for you. Um, to describe that, we would know, for example, the farm and the farmer and the age and the age of the, the steer. Um, we would know uh, how long the butcher has hung it for. Um, we cook it very simple. It's, it's been, as I said, the oldest steakhouse in London. We've got a particular way of doing the steak and that is to let it rest, get it, get it up to temperature, put it on a very, very hot grill. We've got a, a professional grill chef who really knows from touch um, the, the exact um, cuisson right in the middle. Um, he would make sure that you get your steak exactly how you would want it. A lot of people ask for medium rare, we're going to cook one medium rare for you today. Well, the Guinea has a, an extremely extensive wine, wine list. We've got a wine director here who looks after our, our stock of wine. We have a, a fantastic cave full of wine with some wines going back to the 50s on site here. Um, we specialise in Bordeaux really and, and, and heavy reds, although we do have about 20 light reds on the menu too. Um, for the steak you would have today, we would probably recommend something a little off-piste um, that, that would, would go with that. There's a wonderful winery in the Lebanon called um, Chateau Moussard, who make a Bordeaux-style uh, beautiful wine. And we've sold, we were the first uh, restaurant in the UK to sell this wine back in the 70s. It's our biggest selling wine by the bottle now, and Chateau Moussard is very well known worldwide. I think the future for the Guinea Grill is very bright. We have um, a huge book of reservations going forward. Christmas is completely full already, so it's very difficult to actually get a table. We're very, very proud of that. Um, we're delighted that so many of our excellent uh, staff who've been here a long time intend to stay for a very long time. So for the Guinea, we don't expect too much to change. It'd be nice to get a tiny bit busier. Um, however, we're very, very happy with how it's doing and for the future, I'd love to be able to come back here in 20 years time and see everything the same, the same as it was 20 years ago.